डे स्टूडेंट्स इन टेंथ क्लास पार्ट वन इन प्रीवियस सॉरी पार्ट वन टू एंड थ्री वी हैव लर्न अबाउट द पॉलिनोमियल्स एंड इन द जस्ट पार्ट थ्री वी हैव सॉल्व द क्वेश्चन नंबर वन एंड क्वेश्चन नंबर फर्स्ट ऑफ सेकंड क्वेश्चन इन दिस वन फ्रॉम सेकंड क्वेश्चन वी विल सॉल्व सेकंड थर्ड फोर्थ फिफ्थ सिक्स एंड देन टू पॉइंट थ्री ऑल्सो वी विल ट्राई टू सॉल्व इफ यू हैव टाइम ओके इन टू पॉइंट टू क्वेश्चन नंबर टू दिस वन इज द सेकेंड ऑफ द सेकेंड क्वेश्चन okay second question we will solve here in the second question given alpha plus beta according to question it is sum of zeros and this is product of zero if sum and product of zero is given find the polynomial so alpha beta is equal to root 3 and alpha beta is given 1 upon root 3 right now according to equation as we have proved previously that uh, x square minus x alpha plus beta plus alpha beta is equal to 0 we have proved this one so here put the value of alpha beta so this will be x square minus x alpha beta is equal to root 3 so here root 3 plus alpha beta is equal to 1 upon root 3 is equal to 0 now you can take here 1 and by taking lcm this 3 will be multiply here and this will be root 3 x square minus root 3 x plus 1 is equal to 0 this all will come as uh, lcm here root 3 and root 3 will will be divided here so this is the polynomial Or equation root three x square minus root three x plus one. This is the solution. Question number three. In this one, alpha plus beta is given zero. Alpha plus beta is equal to zero, and alpha beta is equal to root five. So equation will be let's put in this one directly. So this will be x square minus alpha plus beta. Alpha plus beta. writing here alpha plus beta into x plus alpha beta is equal to 0 so here x square as it is minus alpha plus beta is equal to 0 so put here 0 multiply by x plus alpha beta is equal to root 5 so this will be root 5 will be equal to 0 so this will become 0 so the equation is x square plus root 5 right this is the answer next one fourth one fourth one is this one alpha plus beta and alpha beta 1 fourth one alpha plus beta is equal to 1 and alpha beta also equal to 1 let's try to put directly in this one that will be x square minus alpha plus beta is equal to 1 right so 1 multiply by x plus alpha beta is equal to 1 so the equation is x square minus x plus 1 this is the solution now fifth one in fifth one see 1 upon 4 and 1 upon if minus 1 upon 4 and 1 upon 4 alpha plus beta is equal to minus 1 upon 4 and alpha beta is equal to 1 upon 4 in this question number 4 now so put the value directly in this one so what to do x square x square minus alpha beta is minus 1 up, alpha plus beta is minus 1 upon 4 plus uh, sorry x and plus alpha beta is 1 upon 4 equal zero you may take so here what will be lcm lcm will be 4 So here what will come one one four ja this will be four x square minus minus plus this is x plus not x four x this is four x plus one is equal to by taking LCM this four will be divide no sorry multiply with zero so this will be zero this is the solution of number four so number five sixth one. Last six one is a alpha plus beta is equal four alpha beta equal one so you may do this one by also by the same method 
okay so both so all are easy most are difficult so i'm lying between them so that you can separate them okay these are the questions next one let's see question number two we have finished now 2.3 in previous class you have learned divisions right division question number three of two point question number one of two point three what is that first one is exercise two point three question number one okay we are going to do this question number one two point three question number one is divide the polynomial px by the polynomial gx question is divide px by gx right px by gx find quotient and remainder in each of the following and verify division algorithm right so in this one first question is given px equal see it carefully px equal x cube minus 3x square plus 5x minus 3 and gx is equal to x square minus 2 right this one given now what to do we have to divide according to this one divide px by gx so we have to take this one before dividing just see this is in standard form or not standard form means it should be in descending order this is already descending order power 3 power 2 power 1 and 0 talking about the power of x it means variable so let's take x here this is uh, x cube minus 3x square plus 5x minus 3 okay we will divide here we will divide by x square minus 2 okay code of division rule and we have already done such type of question in previous classes also what is the way to do we need x cube for this one what to do we have to first multiply this number by x so that we can get x cube so we will multiply by x okay x multiply by x square is equal to x cube and here x will be multiplied by minus 2 also so this will be minus 2x okay but minus 2x is these are not like term so leave this place blank and we will write here like term under like term so 2 into x is equal to minus 2x here now draw a line and change sign this is minus and this is plus x cube to x cube cancel and here 3 minus 3 x square as it is we will take down no need to change sign of this one and here plus 5 plus 2 5 plus 2 is equal to plus 7x and the next number minus 3 you may write here okay next one this by this x square we need 3x square so what to do we need minus 3 okay minus 3 so minus 3 into x square is equal to minus 3x square minus 3 multiplied by minus 2 is equal to 3 to the 6 and plus 6 will come draw a line here this sign chain this will be plus and this will be minus this cancel and this one 7x as it is and this is minus 3 and minus 6 6 what will come minus 9 see now the power of this expression is less than the power of this divisor and this is remainder remainder is less having less power than the divisor so this will be remainder Okay, we cannot divide it more now according to rule let's check uh, in let's check by the division algorithm according to division algorithm quotient that is qx divisor 
that is gx so and this polynomial px means px is equal to gx multiply by qx qx means quotient plus remainder means rx right what is px this one this should come here is equal to gx gx is x square minus 2 x square minus 2 qx is x minus 3 plus remainder is 7x minus 9 okay so this multiply x square to x is equal to x cube let's multiply minus 3 x square minus 2 to x is equal to minus 2x minus 2 minus 3 3 to the plus 6 plus 7x minus 9 as it is equal x cube as it is minus 3x square as it is minus 2x and plus 7x 7 minus 2 is equal to plus 5 5x and minus 9 left see now this is px and we had the px same as it is now we got the same this is the verification verified like this we have to do rest questions also try to do rest question and in next video in part 5 we will solve rest questions also 1 2 3 4 how many are given we will solve and if you did not subscribe please subscribe it thank you very much